Identification yourself for recognition before I... Identification yourself before I... I, I, I release my AK-47. Identification yourself for recognition before I shoot. Say, can I, will you open the gate? Small Majesty, are you? Welcome, Small Majesty. Hey, but, Small Majesty, why you can't they use your futron to the work now? Why the you? did it take you so long to open the gate? Sorry, sir. What were you doing? Eh, hey, Small Majesty, I be the dream. As I did dream for there, I can't win 35 million for Niger bed. I said, what carry the money now? You just can't wake me up. Make I, make I collect the money first, sir. I for collect the money, eh? But now me and Oga Majesty for the drag who get money pass. Will you shut up? Yes, sir. Shut up! So this is how you guide the kid? No, sir. Tell me why you shouldn't lose your job today. Ah, so Majesty. At this work, not to feed my family, make I lose job. I beg, I go explain. Wait, make I explain, I beg. I am not here to argue with you. Yes, sir. Since you've won yourself 35 million, Yes, sir. We're no more at par. Who is inside? Eh. Hey, your sister be there inside, though. Hey, but as I the arrange how to collect the 35 million, whether I don't work out, no, no. Get man. Get man. Sir. Can you just listen to yourself? Yes, sir. I'll be back for you. Me? What is that? Don't use your reggae spoil my blues. Now, you're supposed to change that for me. Just come use the reggae spoil my blues. This 35 million for the collector. To start collecting and for dash and money self. Ah.
Jin. Oh. 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 Jin. Uh. Jin, you are seriously sick. Your Majesty, sir. Someone an emergency meeting. Where are Your Majesty? Honestly, I don't know what is wrong with Jen. What are you talking about? I met her home seriously sick. I'm even calling you from the hospital. They just administered treatment to her. I believe she'll be fine. Come on, see. Just hold, hold it right there. I'll join you immediately. Okay? Um, which hospital? Cancel the board meeting. What's wrong with my daughter? She's okay, sir. It was just a slight fever. I mean, a very little fever. But as I speak with you right now, she's doing great. Are you sure? She's fine. Maybe I should fly her abroad for proper treatment. Come on. Your doctor said she's fine. Yes. Just a slight fever, and he said she's okay. Let her be. She'll be fine. Are you sure? Yes. I don't want anything to happen to her. Nothing is going to happen to her. You have nothing to be afraid of. She's in the safe hands. Oh, please excuse me. I need to attend to other patients. All right, okay. Mm. Angela. Angie. Angie. Dad. That let her be. She's sleeping. Are you sure? Yes. Huh? Is that supposed to be normal breathing? Your Majesty, she's coming out from a fever. That's why she's breathing like that. She's fine. She will be fine. She will. Mommy, she's
Can I? Son? Mom. You have to go home with Dad. Eh? It's already getting late. Let me stay back with Jen. Oh? Right. You're, you're right. Let me stay back with Jen. Dad. Dad. Mm. I'll stay here. Um, both of you should go home. I'm here. Dad. Darling, you don't have to do this. Eh? Remember you have been at the office all day. Just go home and get some rest. Eh? Besides, some of your subjects might be looking for you at the palace. Oh? Oh. How can I rest when, when my angel is here and uh, sick? No, I'll stay here. Mom, please don't push it, all right? Don't push it. You and I know you can't persuade Dad. Let's go. Dad, is the driver and the guard staying here with you too? Um, yes. Um, when you get home, instruct the maids to prepare a special dish for her. You know what she likes best. Make it very hot. Then bring it back immediately. Better, father. Better. Um, okay. You. How are you? Ah, I'm fine. Please get away from my princess. Thank you, father. Hmm. I'm thirsty. Father, don't do that. I'm not a child. Oh. I'm a big girl. Give it. Big girls don't get sick. Mm. Drink. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Come on. Don't take a gulp. A sip. You are sick. Remember? Okay. Yes. The doctor said uh, uh, you are. You will be okay. Mm. But I'm not convinced. I think you should go overseas, abroad, for proper treatment, okay? Come off it, Father. I am fine. I'm better now. Besides, you shouldn't be here. 
You should have been at home resting. Yes. You stress yourself too much. If you had wanted me to be home, you shouldn't have been sick. I won't fall sick again. That's better. But then, I want you to go home. For now, why don't we have the sick girl lie down and <laughs> sleep? Daddy, you will never change. Now nah, just sleep first, my little angel. I love you, Daddy. Come on, sleep, sleep. Oh, easy. Little angel. What? Jane? In the hospital? Oh, that was why Dad left the office hurriedly. And I had to stand in for him all day. But is she that serious? For where? The doctor said it was just a little fever. And she was probably fine before we left the hospital. Can okay, Did the doctor say probably? The doctor said she was fine. Then why did dad stay behind? <sighs> she need not to ask. We're talking about Jane here, remember? Come to think of it. Mom, why is it that dad pays special attention to Jane? Like seriously, want me to answer that? <laughs> Have you forgotten this one? She is your father's mother's reincarnate. Or do you want your father to lose his mother again? Do you? I don't believe in that superstition. Jane. Grandmom's reincarnate. Jane is just a stubborn kid sister that I would love to beat one day. No, who do that? You? <laughs> you beat Jane. <laughs> okay. Prepare to spend the rest of your life in jail. Because Chief William will make sure you are severely punished <laughs> for touching Jane. Mom, mom, honestly, it's unfair. It's unfair. Are we not supposed to be loved equally by dad? Why does he love Jane more? Kenneth, reserve that question for your dad when he comes back so that you can talk to him eyeball to eyeball, man to man. <laughs> Her Majesty, my prince, the food is ready. Okay. Has the foreman left for the hospital? Yes, Her Majesty. Did they go with the food? Yes, Her Majesty. Okay, thank you. You can leave. Hmm. Let me see if His Majesty, your father, will continue to be in the hospital after seeing Nelly and the former. Will he trust them so much to be able to take care of Jane? If Dad wants to sleep in the hospital, that's his business. But he should be reminded that he's a first class king. And he should know when to remove emotions from his personal life as a king. Yes. Oh. Let me go and uh, freshen up first and then come down to the dining. Because I'm looking at that. He will sleep in that house tonight, though. Huh. Oh. Can I? Let's go and eat. Yeah, behind. Honestly, Mom, something has to be done about this. About what? But I love you. You shouldn't bother about that. I love you too, Mom. Come to the dining. I will.
princess, what, what, what's going on? I've been trying to reach you. It's not princess. It's Kenichi. Uh, Kenny? Oh, okay, what about Jane? Jane is hospitalized. Jesus. Which hospital? Doctor, I thought you said I'm fine now. Yeah. So why can't I be discharged? Doctor, I have lectures to attend to. Listen, it's an express order by your father, the king. He ordered you stay behind so you can get enough rest. My goodness. I mean, why did you have to tell my father about this? You should have told him that I'm better now. Excuse me, I'll be back. I don't want to see your face or that of my father's, please. I don't like it here. I want to go home. Hi. I thought Kenneth said someone was very ill. Oh. So you actually want me to die so some girl will come take my place? Well, I'm sorry to disappoint you, honey. I am fine. Nothing is wrong with me. <laughs> of course you'll be fine. And nothing will ever be wrong with you. Of course you know that. Because I love you so much and you are the queen of my life. I love you too. I love you so much. Um, Hope you're feeling better. Yeah, I'm seeing something. Is this really for me? I actually got it for the patient, but it's obvious you're feeling better, so I'll just take Who it Who told you that? It is mine. <laughs> it's mine. Thank you, darling. Mm, but baby, I want to go home. It's alright, you probably need to feel better first. I'm better. You sure? Yeah. Okay, we'll confirm from the doctor. <laughs> Thank you. Look at how you're eating like a hungry man. You love me, la, la, la. You love me, Saturday. Don't mind him. Doesn't know his job. Sure, say no, just Thank you. See, make I tell you. Marry me. Marry me. <laughs> you don't know what you they miss. Our wedding, I don't plan them. I don't plan them. The president of Egypt and the president of Israel, they go attend. Hmm? And for the security during the wedding, I'd already talked to the president of America. Now, American soldiers now go guide us. <laughs> Our wedding go be talk of the town. What it be town? Talk of the country. If I talk of the world, you go see him now. Marry me. Maze, do you know that your mother has lost hope on you? Why could you talk like that? Because you are talking out of, out of point. More. You. See you. <laughs> you now. Mm. Inviting American soldiers on your wedding day. And you're here opening and closing gates. Oh. Maze, mm. cut your coat according to your size. Stop this your rubbish dreams and get focused. You know my size. You know my size. Come make I tell you. Anything where you they talk me, you should they talk and now they talk, cha 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 cha. You don't know who they are. Mama. When I don't collect that my 84 million, eh? Hmm. See, make I tell you. Rose Rose, I go buy for you. Yeah. <laughs> me, I go buy Lamborghini. You know Lamborghini. Mm -hmm. Then the, that one they what they call Porsche. Porsche where whiskey they use. I go buy and give you. Now that one go the car go market. Then you will come see, say, myself will become king. They will call me majesty. This organ majesty will see, so I will be my boy because I will be the chairman of all the majesties. They there, they talk. Marry me if you're wise. Uh -huh. Job small.
I'm bothered about is right here, catching some fun. Uh, Daddy, I told you not to bother about me. I am fine. Yes. I'm perfect. I can see you're fine. Mm. <laughs> well, greetings, Your Majesty. Yes. How are you? I'm fine, sir. You, oh. Um, Dad. Yes. Who is he? Oh, Michael. He's my friend. Friend. Cosmate. No. Right. No, Father. He's a friend of mine. A good friend. Daddy, let's forget about that. I really want to live here. I'm tired of this place. In fact, I am fine. I want to go home. Yes, yes, you're fine. Um, see, 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 honey. I'm not convinced. You're fully recovered, okay? Father, I am. I'm fully recovered. You can ask the doctor. I'm okay. Mm. Mm. Okay. Mm. Yes. Honey. We just have to wait a little longer. Mm -hmm. You need to be fully recovered. I'm fine, Daddy. I'm strong. I want to go home. Loves me well, well. I say he came for me. He loved me well, well. Now which can love be this? Oh, the love is too much. Now which can love be this? Oh, you love me, hell, You love me so day will make me come the one day. You love me so day. What we'll make me come? Oh. Mother! Hi, princess. Mother! <sighs> Welcome home. Thank you. I thought you weren't leaving the hospital today. Well, actually, <laughs> you, you took the words out of my mouth, but she is here at her own insistence. Oh. Father, can you stop already? I am fine. Jenny, I was even planning to visit you today. <laughs> mm, but I'm here, bro. Good to have you back home, sis. Thanks, bro. I am strong. Come on. I'm okay. My princess, I'm so happy that you're all right now. Welcome back home. Thank you, Auntie Eunice. Thank ah, you. Welcome home. All right, let's, let's go in. Do you know, Lola? One God salute for you. Koza! Yes, 
says you're home. Please don't fall sick again. like that? Ah, I'm really very sorry. I didn't want to bother you and your father, so I decided to give you guys some space. But you shouldn't have left like that. I thought you stepped out to get something. My dear, your father, if you do your father, I don't mind. I have to give you guys some space, honestly. Now, are you still in the hospital? In my room. I'm back home. Oh, really? You've been discharged? Yes. I told you I'm fine now. I'm better. Please forget everything that happened. I'm so sorry for that. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> My love, you don't have to apologize. It's not your fault. Uh, what matters is that you're fine, you've been discharged and you're back home. Hmm? Later on, I'll come take you out. Yes, but right now I have to go. I have some work I'm doing. Huh? Mm, it's okay. Later. Oh. Princess, what? Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Don't be sick again, okay? You got almost on the first scared. Hmm? Most especially your father. Get the old man worried again, okay? I'll try not to be sick again. But you know I couldn't have intentionally wanted to be sick. Be I'll strong. be fine. Thank you. And uh <sighs> you're back now. Um she could have gotten you something to drink, father. Father, who did you say that man I met at the hospital was? Oh, but I already told you, he's my friend. My friend? Yes, not just an ordinary friend. He's my boyfriend. We've been dating for years. I could categorically say that he is a wonderful soulmate. 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 Angel. Mm -hmm. A student. medical student for that matter. All this girlfriend, boyfriend stuff is some necessary distraction. No, Daddy. I'm not distracted. And not for someone like Michael. He's an exceptional kind of person. He has influenced my life in so many positive ways. So, uh, he's a nice person, Father. And he cares about me so much. Listen to me, Angel. You don't.
don't need him. He is a distraction. I know what is good for you. As a father, I know. I know that... Now listen. You don't need any relationship now. It's a lot of distraction for a young girl like you who is looking forward, looking to the future, looking to the bright future. You don't need any relationship. Education is your focus. Education is your priority, okay? But father, I've always taken my education seriously. Yes. Well. Always. That's not what is happening now. And it's not possible. Two fists in one mouth. How is it possible? You cannot be carrying on a relationship at the same time as you are very, very focused in your studies. It's not possible. One must give way. And I tell you, as your father, what you need now is your education, your studies. Education. What I expect from you now. And nothing more. Period. My love, I don't see anything wrong in Jane having a boyfriend now. I think she's old enough for that. Really? Old enough? Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Oh my God. Her education is what matters now. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? That young man is a distraction. No, 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 no. Michael is no distraction. I think that young man is a very nice person. Hmm. Is that so? A nice person. Yes, nice. Very nice. Why don't you bring Ubakwa and start playing it? Nice, nice, nice. What's wrong with you? Eh? So, you knew all along. And you encouraged it. No, I never encouraged anything. I only found out when they were already involved. And I discovered that the young man is a very nice person. So I only advised her to be careful so that she doesn't get pregnant in the future and ruin her future. Is that so? Ah! Can you listen to yourself? Take a time, take a moment. Reason out what you just said. Take a little time and listen to yourself. Ah! So this is the best advice a reasonable mother would give her teenage daughter. Is that? Now listen. Talk to your daughter. Talk to her. Let her go back to her education. Now listen. Her education is her future. Reading medicine is not like every other course. It is difficult. Come on, talk to her. Talk to your daughter. Her education is her future. Let her concentrate. Her future means everything, not relationship. Please, talk to your daughter. Talk to her. Talk. Talk, I You are once a loving father. All the love and care you gave me What happened to you? What happened to you? My old 
face Asking to be with the one I love Then you turn is bad. I was just testing. I'm a mechanic. I was just testing the car. I don't know what happened to the steering. I'm sorry. Did you just say the car is bad? I'm sorry. The car is, is, that, is that what you just said? That the car, that the car is bad? Listen now. Nicole, I'm sorry. Oluchi, did you, did you see what just happened? Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Sorry, so the car is bad. You didn't see any other place to test the car. It's on me? Calm down. The steering got locked. I don't know how it happened. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. It's okay. I saw what happened. I saw what happened. Oh. Thank God I did not break, break your legs. I can't believe it. Oh, Oluch, I can't just believe what happened right now. Jane, it's okay. It, it, it's okay. Nah, it's good. What's it good? Is this how people die? We should be thanking God that nothing happened to any of us. Please. If you were in Ashuja, I believe you would have acted the same way or even more. Don't tell me to calm down. Look at my dress. Look at my body. I'm looking so dirty and I can't, I can't go out like this. He has to come and take me home. With this same car. With this car? Jane, this car is not in order. His punishment is that he's going to go get another car while this man remains here. This one is going to be here while you go get another car and come take me home. I'm not moving an inch. I don't have another car. It will still be... It's none of my business. You will have to find another car and come take me home. Jane, calm down. I am not happy. Don't tell me you're sorry. You want to kill me and tell me you're sorry. You don't know how to drive. You carry the car and you want to kill somebody. It is true this guy is a mechanic. It is true that he erred. But we should be thanking God that nothing happened to any of us. If you had slapped him just once, I won't complain. You know, sometimes I don't like how you manage your anger. For you to slap a man twice and he didn't react, that's what makes him a man. Please, I want you to say sorry to him. Excuse you. Oluchuku, you must be kidding me. I should tell him sorry for what? Oh, because you're not the one rightly involved. What if he had broken my waist or my leg? Is this what you'd be saying? Please, if this is why you stopped me, I want to go. I know you can't say sorry, but at least he tried by dropping us off here with someone else's car. If you don't want to say sorry, it's fine. Let's go. Wait. Hi. I... 
Please, what's your name? Michael. Um, Michael, I want to apologize for slapping you. I'm sorry I did. I was really angry. So, I give you. I'm sorry. I'm also sorry. I guess it's my fault. But I've never seen a woman with such temperament. Honestly, I'm not like this. I'm usually not like this. Just that someone got me angry earlier, so I, I probably transferred it to you. <laughs> Thought as much. Anyway, I'm sorry. You are such a gentleman. I mean, some other guy would have retaliated. A wise man never lays his hands on a woman, no matter <laughs> what. Wow. We are very sorry. Please forgive us. Can I also know your name? My name is Oluchiku. Oluchi for short. I'm Jane. Bye bye. Bye. I can't believe I was just about to call you. Really? Yes, really. I just had a bath and I got out and since then it's just been you on my mind. So how are you? Have you had something to eat? I feel better. I'm better, trust me. Just that. I miss you. And if you will be free, I'd like to see you tomorrow. Good to see you. <laughs> it's good to see you too. <laughs> How are you? I'm great. I'm oh, so sorry. And um, this is my boyfriend, oh, okay. Michael. Okay. Michael, this is Collins, the only son of Senator Ken. Oh, <laughs> Michael. Uh, it's a pleasure. Good to see you. <laughs> Come on, Mike. So how are you? I'm good. Come on, sit down. Thank you. Wow. You did do well. Uh, you traveled and you never called anyone. That's don't so nice. Say that. Jane, I know you never wanted me to bother you, so I respected that decision. Even <laughs> though it's one of the most difficult decisions I've ever made. Mm -hmm. Oh yes. <laughs> Please, you will never change. The beautiful one. Uh huh. I love it. <laughs> Fascinating. Outstanding. Oh God. Magnificent. Amazing. I don't feel like that. Is it okay? Um, uh, 
he will be fine. Then no. Oh my god. Oh, like everything. Then no. Then no. How are you? Everything is okay. Like god, I can never be able to see you for a long time. <laughs> Good afternoon, my dear. How are you? I'm fine, ma. Um, please, where's Michael? Ma, I thought you guys left together. Yes, we did, but he left before me. He didn't return here. No, ma, he didn't return. Where could he have gone to? Ma, I hope all is well. Um, all is well. Thank you. Baby, I'm talking to you. Are you going to keep asking me like you don't know why? Huh? No, tell me you don't know. Tell me you don't know. I know where you're headed, but to tell you the truth, there is nothing behind it. Nothing. Really? Yes. Nothing behind it. And I'm supposed to believe that. Huh? Like, 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 like I'm a child, right? I should just believe anything you're telling me. Come on. Please, come on. I'm not a child. Okay, I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm an adult. I mean, that... Listen, if you want to be with that guy, just let me know. It's obvious. Okay, fine. It, it's, we're not of the same class. Okay? He's a rich guy from a wealthy home. Probably studied abroad or something. He's the kind of person you should be with. I'm a poor guy who's just trying to make something out of my life. You want to be with him? Let me know. Baby. Tell me to my face. Let me go. Baby, okay? It's simple. I'll just go. Stop it. Don't make me look stupid. Stop it. What is wrong with you? What are you saying? What do you think of me? 
Did I, did I not see him before I chose you? Come on. Listen, babe. I really love you. I have nothing with him. Absolutely nothing at all. I'm sorry for everything that happened. But to tell you the truth, my dear, there is nothing between us. You know I love you. And I will continue to love you forever. Baby, come on. I love you too. Mm -hmm. 